And then you find out that in actuality, he was a bad guy all along. He was secretly a globalist guy. That's why he would turn up at the World Economic Forum and United Nations things. And then you go, so he was a bad guy, but he wasn't bad for the reasons I thought he was bad in the 80s. Then he becomes a good guy for me in about 2012 or so. And he's a good guy for me for about six years. And then I find out in actuality, he's a bad guy because he's a globalist uh, who wants a new world order and a one world government. But, and he's doing Louis Vuitton ads. Uh, but so he's a bad guy, but he's not a bad guy for the original reasons I had. He's a bad guy for something totally different. So I've had to. I've had to keep my head on a swivel, you know what I mean? And I, and I've had to try to be as humble about this information as possible because, you know, this is what I believe given the information that I currently have. But I, I fully understand that sometimes new information is brought to light. Things that you thought you knew turn out to not necessarily be true. So I always want to give myself that, the flexibility, I guess, to, to, to change my mind on things. If new and better information is presented, like the last thing I want to do is be so, you know, tied to a particular narrative because that that's what I always believe to be true. Or that's what I believe to be true. Even though new information has come up and has said, well, actually there's some of this is, isn't exactly as you, as you believed it to be. I want to know the truth. Even if it means that I was wrong about some stuff, I can live with that, fine with that. Actually, frankly, it means that you're kind of, you're still looking, <laughs> which I think is a good sign, right? Mm -hmm. If you're still, what you don't want to do is you don't want to get to a place where you're like, oh, I'm done knowing the truth. I'm good. I've put it in my books. I've put it in my podcast. I don't need anything to interfere with it. Listen, if something comes up and I'm wrong about something, then let's talk about it. You know, I'm, then I'm wrong about it. And that's okay. I can, hell, I've been wrong about plenty of things and will continue to be wrong. But what I don't want to do is be wrong and then like double down digging. on it. Yeah. That yeah. seems like, that seems like the opposite of what we're trying to accomplish here. We're trying to figure out how it all fits. Right. Right. And I don't have all the pieces and, and, and I welcome people that do have all the pieces. And if I've got two pieces that I've got fit to get, you know, how you figure you're in a jigsaw puzzle and you go, oh, they pretty much fit. Like they kind of fit. They look like they should fit.